Welcome everyone, I'm Martin Tyler, he's Alan Smith and we're going to talk about this match today from the commentary position. Hi there Martin, yeah and expecting big things here, there's a great atmosphere. And it's Chelsea today versus Manchester United. Oh, what a match we've got Martin, first v second, I know it's still fairly early on in the season but uh, we've got two great sides here, should be some fantastic football out there. Our referee for this game is Ian Lowcroft. Manchester United getting the first half underway. Dangerous to the... He can have a crack here. He stopped the first shot. And now Lampard. Ramirez. So dangerous. Oh, he didn't panic there, De Gea. Did very well in the circumstances. And that will be a corner for Chelsea. Well, the defender panicking there. He just got the ball away. He just can't get out at the moment. It's a good clearance in one way, but it's only just bought them a few extra seconds to reorganise. And now we'll have a goal kick. Here's Van Persie. He's really sensing an opportunity now, Robin Van Persie. And it could be for Manchester United. Fantastic try. United's corner. It didn't. And Manchester United have made it count. They've scored. And up he went, climbed so well, perfectly done, it flew in. He did, so easy to miss time that, but his jump was spot on. The opposition got caught flat-footed there, they weren't ready, they weren't in position. As a result, this corner routine worked a treat. Well, that's the first goal of the game, it's 1-0. Mikel. Well read by the defender to intercept. I do think this team are clever when they do attack. Just like this, they're playing... Here's the chance! You could be caught out so often by this, officials and indeed commentators, is why I, I usually say he's given offside rather than it is offside. We get the replays, they don't. The game is so quick these days, it's almost an impossible job for the linesman, but fair play. We got that one spot on. Ramirez. Sturridge. And it's Lampard. Great opportunity. Fernando Torres. Chelsea have become much more fashionable as a team. Always uh, in a fashionable part of London, the southwest of London, the King's Road and all that was part of their image, Alan. Yeah, it has always been that way. My old manager, Joe. Robin Van Persie. The service was superb. The shot wasn't. Yeah, there you go. On a plate. But just couldn't take advantage. Now Terry. Cole. And the 
to alternatives for him to play the ball. The attacking support is good. Keeper can deal with that. Kagawa intercepted the play. Saw the pass coming. Oh, and they're on the. He's got through them. Sturridge. Fernando Torres, and it's there, and that levels the match. Well, that's the way to head a goal. Yeah, he got power, he got accuracy, perfect. Great movement in the box from him to start off with, to get the room, and then once the chance came, a header. Oh, what a thumping effort it was. Well, we're back at level pegging again at 1-1. Kagawa. Ryan Giggs. How does he cut that out? Wonderful play. Everest tackle. It's Mikel. Good challenge. Good contest. That's a good pass. And this could be Cole going all the way. Oh, the attack has done well, beating his man. Hits it well. Well, he saved it. It's still in play. And he's in there with a the header. Into the goalkeeper's midriff. Always huge worldwide interest in Manchester United. But the United fans around the globe will be a little bit concerned about the strength of the opposition. They're going to make life tough for Manchester United from a defensive point of view. They can be resilient on the back foot. Good pass. Goes for goal. Still danger. This is the chance. Can they turn it in? And in comes the header. Manchester United with the ball again. Well, there might be a break now for them. Quick counter-attack was on, but in the end, it came to nothing. And it's going to be an attacking... And the shot at the end of it. Well, that's a fantastic clearance. He rose to the occasion and saved the day. Set right in the heart of affluent southwest London, Stamford Bridge. And there's a teammate free in the middle here. And the defender has done very well here, got his foot in. Here is Lampa. Makes a challenge here. Trying to screen it against the challenge now. Excellent passing here. He shoots. And it's in the net for the goal. And that is a very difficult skill. A volley of some venom. Yeah, if you get it functionally off, it goes high and wide. But he got it spot on. Looking good for Manchester United. They are trailing in this game. Ryan Giggs. Ever on the ball. Robin Van Persie. The work rate here is absolutely incredible. His manager must absolutely love him, the work rate he gets through. It's a back pass to Fedacek. David Luiz. Mikel. Good interplay, and they're keeping possession as well. Good ball. And that little deflection has sent the ball over the touchline. Valencia fighting to win possession. Eden Hazard, he's brilliant on the ball. He wants to go past defenders. Nani. Kagawa. Well, Chelsea do hold the lead, but with half-time beckoning, we'll see whether they can get there with that lead still intact and indeed see it out for the rest of the game. Here's the cross. And he heads it for goal. Still danger after the save. Play building up nicely now. Here's the shot. It's the crossbar. And bravely in. Frank Lampard. It's a certain goal. And it's in. The header. Great goal. Good power on the cross. And he steered it in. 
with a deft flick of the neck muscles. Well, he made it really difficult for the defenders the way he timed his run from the back there, and they just couldn't contain him. But it's a good effort, and I think it was a good save. And he could do nothing about it. The only criticism of the keeper you would have, Martin, is he didn't carry it away out of the danger zone. And it's 3-1. The goals keep on coming. Antonio Valencia. Scopes. And here comes Giggs. Shots on goal, let's have a look at the comparison. And he's in behind them. Chance for Chelsea. He's gone for goal. Superb from De Gea. Corner now from Frank Lampard. And it's with Giggs. Two more minutes to be played then, added time. Nani. Valencia. And the pass cut out at a truly vital time. Rio Ferdinand. That's uh, half-time now, and the score is 3-1. All that is at stake in this local derby. Well, it's still up for grabs despite the fact we've got a team leading at half-time, but it is only half-time in the derby. Well, it is. 45 minutes for the trailing side to come back, and I'd expect a spiky response from them.